The small luxury sedan may be a declining sector in terms of sales, but that doesn't mean luxury companies aren't competing for your money with ever-improving four-door options. There are now roughly a dozen entry luxury cars to choose from. No, they aren't all BMW 3 Series and Mercedes-Benz C-Classes, and with so many alternatives, finding the correct choice is difficult. That's where we come in. We've driven every candidate in the small luxury sedan class. 2021 Infiniti Q50 The current Infiniti Q50 has been with us for several years and has seen incremental changes over the course of its life cycle. For 2021, some newly standard safety kit was added to the aging luxury sedan. The Q50 still offers a number of engine choices, including a potent 400 horsepower turbocharged V6 for the Red Sport 400 model, but it's lacking in other areas. The Q50's infotainment setup is both laggy and unintuitive. Not only that, the ride is too firm, and the car doesn't stack up dynamically. The Q50 is Infiniti's last available sedan, a compact offering also available as the stylish, two-door Q60. Since it was introduced for the 2014 model year, the Q50 has seen the addition of a Red Sport 400 performance variant as well as the loss of hybrid and four-cylinder offerings. The Q50 competes with other luxury compact sedans including the Genesis G70, Audi A4, Alfa Romeo Giulia, and Tesla Model 3. 2021 Lexus is Despite a major overhaul for 2021, the Lexus is remains near the bottom of our rankings for luxury compact sedans. The changeover from 2020 to 2021 brought with it a huge makeover, both inside and out, plus improved handling dynamics. Not only that, but Lexus finicky infotainment system has finally been overhauled, features a touchscreen, and is much more intuitive than before. However, the IS is powered by a set of aging powertrains, and it's slower than most of its rivals, though the new for 2022 V8 powered IS500 will change that. Targeted at European compact sport sedans including the BMW 3 Series and Audi A4, the Lexus's returns to the segment thoroughly revised. It's not an all-new car, but extensive updates to exterior styling, interior features, and under-the-skin hardware distinguish 2021 as from its predecessors. 2021 Cadillac CT5 The 2021 CT5 is Cadillac's most recent stab at the compact luxury sedan segment, and it's essentially a replacement for the CTS and ATS we enjoyed so much. Build quality was subpar, and the CT5 was criticized for being both slow and dynamically unimpressive. The more powerful and sportier CT5 V changes that incorrects many of the base car's dynamic faults, and there's a Blackwing model on the way with a hulking great V8 that should give the German competition a real run for its money. Even so, there are better options than the standard CT5 out there. This is the Cadillac CT5, the largest sedan in Cadillac's lineup following the departure of the full-size CT6. Cadillac introduced the CT5 for the 2020 model year as a replacement to the CTS. GM's fantastic Super Cruise semi-autonomous system is finally available this year, but even if you don't tick that option box, buyers will appreciate the newly standard active safety features. The CT5 competes against other compact luxury sedans including the BMW 3 Series, Alfa Romeo Giulia, Volvo S60, and Audi A4. 2021 Acura TLX The Acura TLX is all new for 2021. A new from the ground up design takes inspiration from the extremely hot Type S concept, while the new chassis delivers better, shaper handling. But despite all the newness, some flaws remain. Acura's infotainment system has a steep learning curve and might frustrate some buyers, and there isn't the option for a hybrid model, something most of the competition now offers. A new TLX Type S is on the way that will feature more power and sharper dynamics, but the base TLX still has some work to do before it can compete with the very best in this segment. All new for 2021, the TLX showcases Acura's latest in design and performance. It continues a lineage of Acura sedans stretching back decades, following the vigor from the early 1990s, a few generations of the TL starting in 1995, and the first-gen TLX that made its debut in 2014. For 2021, the new TLX features an edgy exterior design, dramatic proportions, a tech-forward cabin, and a choice between turbocharged engines. One of those, an all-new V6, is exclusive to the TLX Type S, which revives Acura's performance sub-brand after more than a decade out of the US market. The 2021 TLX will go on sale in the fall of 2020, and the TLX Type S will be available from early 2021. 2021 BMW 3 Series You used to be able to sum up the BMW 3 Series with one word, benchmark. A better word, for now, would be middling, as the latest 3 Series has landed mid-pack on our ultimate rankings list. 
Despite its powerful engine options and well-built interior, the M Sport suspended 3 Series rides far too stiffly for our tastes. Not only that, but start adding some useful options to the base 3 Series and it can get very pricey very quickly. As it closes in on 5 decades in production, the BMW 3 Series maintains standard setter status among compact luxury sport sedans. Now in its 7th generation, the current G23 Series debuted for the 2019 model year. As always, it aims to balance performance, luxury, and technology to provide drivers with a signature BMW experience. For 2022 it's available in different performance levels topping out with the legendary M3 or as a plug-in hybrid. 2021 Mercedes-Benz C-Class The Mercedes-Benz C-Class has become a mainstay sedan for the three-pointed star. Now in its fourth generation, the C-Class is as good as it's ever been. Much like its counterpart from Munich, the C has potent and efficient four- and six-cylinder engines to choose from, and of course Benz's answer to BMW's M3, the wicked Mercedes-AMG C63, for those who must have the fastest version of everything. AMG aside, the standard C-Class offers a good ride handling balance, loads of tech, and bank vault-like interior quality, everything you'd expect from a good Benz. But it is worth noting that soon, much of that will change. A new C-Class is on the way, and it's powered by an all-four-cylinder lineup, even the C63 loses its V8. That said, the new C-Class promises more refinement and tech than ever before. Stay tuned for our impressions of the new C. From the 503 horsepower AMG Coupe to the practical four-cylinder sedan, Mercedes-Benz offers a wealth of options with its compact C-Class. The German luxury automaker introduced the current generation C-Class for 2015 and gave the model a mid-cycle facelift for 2019. Within the Mercedes-Benz car lineup, the C-Class is positioned above the subcompact A and CLA class but below midsize E and full-size S-Class sedans. The long-running small Mercedes competes against other compact luxury sedans, including the Genesis G70, Tesla Model 3, Audi A4, and BMW 3 Series. 2021 Alfa Romeo Giulia A former Motor Trend Car of the Year award winner, the 2021 Alfa Romeo Giulia now resides outside the top three places in our rankings. But that doesn't mean you're not getting a great compact luxury sedan if you were to pick the Giulia. A refresh for 2020 bestowed the Giulia with a slightly nicer interior and a snappier infotainment display. It also maintains its superb ride or handling balance and is gorgeous to boot. This former KT winner is still a contender worthy of a long, hard look. 2021 Volvo S60 The 2021 Volvo S60 is the only suite on this list, and it also might be the best-looking car of the lot. The S60 represents an interesting alternative to the German trifecta of mid-size luxury sedans. Even though we love the way it looks and commends Volvo for its commitment to safety, the S60 isn't exactly the handling maestro of its segment. Not only that, but its hybrid powertrains can feel clunky despite the extra power they deliver. The S60 is a gorgeous, comfortable, and stunningly well-built luxury midsize sedan. It's just not the best one you can buy. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.